Listening 012, Unit 2, Psychology. By the end of Unit 2, you'll be able to distinguish the main ideas from a radio program about the concept of flow, and state what people are talking about in the radio program about the concept of flow. Unit 2, Listening Trap. <clears throat> Unit 2, Listening Track, a radio program about the concept of flow. Please pause your screen go to Blackboard and pull up the soundtrack and listen to it. After you've listened to it, please join me. Now, all of the multiple choice questions I would like you to answer in the discussion board. Number one, flow is described by psychologists as a state of A, optimal experience, or B, deep relaxation. Number two, a person can experience flow during A, one or two types of activities only, or B, many different activities. Number three, flow is A, the same as feeling happy, or B, different from feeling happy. Now, I want you to listen again and you know where to access it in Blackboard. Write T for true or F for false for each statement. I'll read the statements for you. Number one, the concept of flow was described by psychologists, true or false. Number two, the psychologist describes being a chef in a restaurant to explain flow, true or false. Number three, it is typical to lose a sense of time and to forget your problems when experiencing flow, true or false. Number four, both skill and challenge are required to experience flow, true or false. Number five, you can experience flow in both physical and non-physical activities. Number six, According to the speaker, watching TV is sometimes likely to produce flow. Number seven, reading is not a typical activity that produces flow. Remember, all of these questions are true or false. And number eight, it is possible to feel happy without experiencing flow. True or false? Please put all of your true or false selections in the discussion board. Now, I want you to listen to the radio program again. After listening to it, Write a blog stating what people are talking about in the radio program. You'll find the blog in your blackboard on the left-hand side.